So I'm at this garage sale all day. And um, um, so anyway, when we leave to go to Atlanta, I, I actually didn't like put on a fresh change of clothes. I said, you know what, we're going to get to Atlanta. And when we check in the hotel, I'll get all freshened up and prettied up. I just want to get out of here. Just let's just get on the road and just go because, you know. And so that's what we did. I didn't I actually didn't comb my hair. Um, I didn't brush my teeth. I didn't put on clean clothes. I was going to do all of that when we got to Atlanta. When we got to Atlanta, we had requested an early check in. And the hotel says that um, they weren't able to grant us the early check in. And I'm thinking, you're kidding, right? Like, I need to comb my hair. I need to change clothes. I need to do the things that I need to do. And the class was starting, like, in minutes. And I really just had enough time to get in the hotel and to do all of what I needed to do and get down to the class. The class was at the same um, hotel. And I realized that I was not going to have time to do any of that. And I'm looking at my clothes, and I'm like, okay, this is a food stain on here, and my hair doesn't look good, and uh, what am I going to do? So, But I need to get in class. So I go in, I walk in, and I, you know, <clears throat> clear my throat and try to straighten out my clothes. And I get up to the table, and I say, hi, I'm Melanie Armstrong here for the braiding class. Um, but you know what? I don't normally look like this. Um, and I went into this you know, just a lot of excuses of why I was, my clothes was wrinkled and why I looked the way I looked. And I remember the instructor, um, she was looking down and she looked up at me and she didn't say anything. And she waited until I was finished. And she said, you know what? If you hadn't have told me any of that, I wouldn't have known any of that. And I'm telling you, that was a aha moment for me. That was, that was a teaching moment for me. And I thought to myself, it was my perception of myself. She didn't see any of that. And I took that and I learned a lot from that. I've never forgotten that. Mm. You know, so, so many moments like that, right, where we hold ourselves back. I mean, if, 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 if I were in that situation, I might have skipped the class, yeah. you know, I would have been so embarrassed. I mean, but so many situations we hold ourselves back because right. of insecurity. And it's like, people aren't even thinking about you in that way. They're not. Yeah.